don't drink alcohol. How could you defy the whole social stereotype being a university student? How have you got through a whole four years of university without drinking? You must be so boring. You must never go out. It's only one drink, like, what's the big deal? If you don't drink, just go to religious circus events instead. Like, I don't understand why we have to have an event for people like you. Why do you feel so uncomfortable that everything's focused around drinking? You should loosen up. You should have some fun sometimes. But why? Seriously. Why? Why don't you drink? You can tell me, like, it's fine, just like, tell me. Why won't you tell me? Hi, my name's Lydia. I'm a medical student here in the UK, and welcome to my channel, The Dyslexic Medic. So, all the things I said at the start of the video are actually comments that have been made to me during my four years of university. Some of them repeated turns over, as in like, I'm constantly asked as soon as I say, I don't drink. Shock, surprise, if you haven't read the video title, I don't drink. I currently don't, I currently never have, and I don't know if I ever will, but like, I don't know what future Olivia's gonna be like. See what medicine does to me. Here's the thing I found, like, people get really uncomfortable when I tell them I don't drink and I don't really get why. That's actually like, I do get why because I think I'm like internally judging them for their life choices and that I will remember all the embarrassing things they do while inebriated. There are some people at university who won't meet my eye anymore. Here's another shocking fact for you, I don't care. Unless you're a patient, in which I do care because like, it's part of how you could do a full clerking of somebody is asking them about their alcohol history, that's quite important. In a social situation, I don't really care. So here's the deal about not drinking. If you don't want to drink, don't. Don't feel like you have to fit in with your peer group. There are lots of reasons why people don't drink. Um, and honestly, it's nobody's business. People seem determined. They've got to like know because you're like this abnormal human being and they don't know how you function without alcohol. And it's crazy concepts that I've got really like, it's quite a minor thing. People are determined to ask in depth of why you don't drink, but apparently it's aggressive and not appropriate to turn around to someone and be like, so why do you drink? Because I don't know. Double standards? So in answer to some of these questions, I do go out and I do have an enjoyable time with my friends. It is possible to go out, not drink, and have a fun time. I've done it for four years, so trust me, it is possible. My pocket and my head thank me afterwards, and I normally come back very well hydrated. When I used to go out with my friends, which was pre-Covid and pre-most of fourth year. Personally, compared to other people, I have more of a time limit on my phone. I don't really like being surrounded by sweaty drunk people. Some people are fine with it, I just don't feel comfortable so I go ahead. There are some people who go out, I go out clubbing and have a great time, I avoid that because I just don't really enjoy it that much. But that's just me, that's not representative of all non-drinkers and that's not representative of all drinkers. How have I got through university socials? Quite easily because nobody really cares what you are imbibing in a circle or at a social as long as you are participating and that is like the number one thing which I can encourage you to do if you don't drink or if you do drink is really participate in things like if you want to get you involved or chat or play games or whatever get involved and have fun people don't care if you've got a beer or a cup of tea in your hand as long as you're willing to participate why don't you go to religious events instead um because I might not follow that religion because I might not be comfortable with aspects of that religion. They're just society events I've been to and they're fantastic, but people, some people aren't comfortable with going to religious society events and that's okay. You shouldn't just lump non-drinks in saying we can't be bothered to do this because someone else does it. Like, even though that group of people might, might not be very representative of the people who want to have a non-alcoholic event or have an event where drinking isn't like the main thing of happening at that event. Why do you feel uncomfortable when everything is centred around drinking? This is very subjective. In cases where it's like a club night, you're like, everyone's going to be drinking. In cases where it tends to be like, for me it tends to be more like a daytime event where alcohol like isn't really like 
that necessarily like you could have that exact same event and have no alcohol and basically they have no difference it's also the opinion that you can't have fun while sober which is just incorrect i have plenty of fun while sober um in fact all of my fun is while i have them while i'm sober loosen up have fun my idea of fun is knitting and watching tv so fun is also a very different thing for different people what i find fun which is like knitting most people think a are you a grandma or b that sounds dull as doornails that's fair enough just because your idea of fun isn't someone else's idea of fun doesn't make it less valid so why don't you drink as i said before in the nicest way that's nobody's business except mine when people ask me this i just say I don't want to and for those people who I want to tell like this sort of more lengthy explanation of things I will tell them but those tend to be a very small select group of people who I tend to be very very close with so it's not going to be the random person who I meet in a pub yeah just please stop asking us people's reasons differ it could be religious it could be personal apart from this being a slight rant about the number of times I've been asked about why don't I drink? And all of these other questions. There is an important point here. Whether you drink or not, it's your choice and people shouldn't be questioning it in a social situation. Yeah, it's my choice. And so why does it matter so much to you? Is it going to impact on your night? Probably not. Do I defy the social stereotype of a student? Why yes, yes I do. Do I intend to? No, that is not the reason why I don't drink. Are there growing numbers of people joining me? Yes, yes there are. Our numbers are growing. For anyone starting uni who doesn't drink, you've got this. It might be painful sometimes, and it might feel like just such an annoying thing to deal with. And people might question it and make you feel uncomfortable, but if you're on a group of people who make you feel uncomfortable about it, just leave if it's safe to do so but like you will find a group of friends and a group of people who accepts you and accepts the fact that you don't drink and will treat you no differently the fact you do that it can take a bit of time in summary you've got this it'll be okay and good luck at uni that's all for now stay safe wash your hands bye for now Ugh. What am I doing? What am I doing? So what the same thing the middle of the Oh not my script. Move on, look at script, check script. What am I talking about again? It makes me sound really boring. Editing is a wonderful thing. <laughs> People don't know how much I ramble.